Hey friends, happy Wednesday and welcome back to another weekly grocery haul and meal plan. Today I have a haul to share with y'all from Aldi. I did manage to stay under a budget this week. I didn't feel like we needed a ton of things. My list seemed very short, but then we found some like new items they were putting out and a couple clearance finds. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you the meal plan and then we'll get into the haul. Okay, here is the meal plan for the week. We're gonna have ground pork and rice. That's a new recipe. Cube steak and gravy. Lemon pork loin, and then we're gonna do like some roasted potatoes and stuff with it. Uh, chicken enchilada casserole, that's made in the crock pot. Chicken burrito bowls, that's made in the instant pot. Cowboy beans, and ham fried rice. Okay, here is everything that I got today at Aldi. As I said, not too much on my list today. We'll start over here with the produce. We got some bell peppers, raspberries, blackberries. Got some tomatoes, blueberries. Autumn crisp grapes are back. We love these. They are green seedless grapes, sweet and delightfully crisp with a subtle muscat aroma. We get these every fall. Um, they'll have them for the next few months and we love them. They also have a different one in the springtime that's really good too, but I think the autumn ones are our absolute favorite. Got the romaine. Then we got two things of strawberries. These were on sale this week for $1.45. Um, so I got two of them. We're gonna actually put one of them in the freezer to use in our new little kitchen appliance. I got on the Buy Nothing group on Facebook. It's called a Yo Nana's, and it turns frozen fruit into like little soft serve so like frozen bananas and frozen strawberries do really well in it um so we're gonna freeze one and then have one to have with with breakfast or lunch or whatever just for eating we got a pineapple onions sunburst blend bite-sized potatoes two cucumbers some bananas some of those will also probably get frozen we froze about half the bananas that we had from last week um, we also froze the rest of our strawberries. I froze some kiwi and I froze some blueberries this morning. Whatever hadn't been used up, I threw in a container, threw it in the freezer, and we can make some like soft serve with that later. Then we got some lemonade and strawberry lemonade, two things of orange juice, two things of Fairlife milk, some mini hash brown patties. These just looked really good. I'm not sure how many they are but they're definitely smaller than like the usual hash brown patties. They feel like they're like this big. So we'll see. Then we got some jumbo flaky biscuits, the Canadian bacon, indulgent honey vanilla Greek yogurt. They don't have the strawberry or the cookies and cream anymore. Um, I'm wondering if those are like gone because they started putting out the caramel one again. Um, so maybe they're bringing in the fall flavors. So we just got regular honey vanilla. We got some broccoli and frozen mixed vegetables. Lily's extra sharp white cheddar cracker cuts. Sliced sharp cheddar and a bag of Mexican style cheese. Got more sparkling waters. We got two of the cranberry flavored water, a key lime, a black cherry, and then three of the juicy peach because that's our favorite. Then we got two cream of chicken a can of diced tomatoes, a bag of rice, some bacon bits, chunky salsa, saltines. This cheesecake mix was on clearance for like $1.45. It was regularly priced like almost $5. So we got that for a fun little treat. Maple syrup because we were almost out. Fully cooked bacon to make my life simpler. We need some bacon for cowboy beans so that'll just make it a little bit easier some Oreos, fake Oreos, Aldi brand Oreos, double stuffed, large burrito sized flour tortillas, corn tortillas, one of my favorite energy drinks of all time, the Prime Dream Pop. This tastes like an orange creamsicle. It is so good. And I bought them like the last month, I feel like, from Aldi. I go buy one here and there. Originally, they were 
two dollars i think two dollars and some change maybe they went down to 179 169 today they were on clearance for 109 which is a great deal cheaper than any of the primes that i buy at dollar tree um so i bought all that they had left which was 17. um andy does not drink this flavor he's not much of a cream sickle guy uh so this will last me just over two weeks when I drink one a day and I'm excited. I have lots of dream pop for myself. Then we found this Arnold Palmer light half and half, half iced tea, half lemonade. This was I think $1.74 and I think originally this was close to six bucks. So we got that for a little drink. At least me and Lily will drink that, possibly Elijah. He's gonna try it. He's only had an Arnold Palmer I think from Chick-fil-A and their, um, lemonade is very pulpy and he does not like that so i think he'll like this because he likes sweet tea he likes lemonade so maybe he'll like this uh we got some restaurant style tortilla chips because the kids wanted that kind this week we got some 100 percent whole wheat bread usually we get the honey wheat but this week i just wanted whole wheat we also have some honey wheat left from last week then i needed some thin sliced chicken breasts so i got that for 431 some pork sausage for making Andy's breakfast burritos. We need one thing of ground beef. And we needed some paper towels. And then we each also got a drink. I got a Coke Zero because we were thirsty when we got there. And they got a Sprite and they're sharing it. But that is everything from Aldi. Okay, as I said at the beginning, I was able to stay under my weekly budget. My weekly budget is typically $200. And this week I spent right at $150, which I think is really good for what I got. I'm stocked up on energy drinks for myself for like the next two weeks. So I won't have to worry about that unless I just see a new flavor of something that I wanna try. Um, like, there's not even a new flavor I want to try. There's Alani's Witch's Brew. If Aldi gets that in, I definitely will buy probably one a week um, as long as they have them because I love that flavor. I had found it originally at Dollar Tree um, and that's one of my favorite flavors of energy drink. Um, followed by the Prime Ice Pop and then probably this Prime Dream Pop. Those are probably my top three favorite energy drinks but the witch's brew doesn't come out very often it's like a halloween special um, when i found them last year it was like after halloween at dollar tree um, haven't seen them since it's like caramel apple flavored it's delicious if you like that kind of flavor and you like energy drinks recommend trying that also recommend the primes because i love those as well but that is going to be it for this week's haul i hope that y'all enjoyed it if you did make sure you leave me a thumbs up and i will see y'all in the next one bye